Hey internet, I'm Mike Bryce and welcome back to more of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe 200 CC playthrough. Oh my gosh, the day is finally here. It is release day for Wave 4 of the Booster Course Pass. I am so freaking excited. We have eight amazing looking tracks in this wave, but in this episode we are going to be taking on the first cup, which is the Fruit Cup. And as we can see, we have a new character, and I'm actually really surprised at how they did this, uh, or how they're adding the new characters. And is this confirmation for how many characters we're getting? Are we getting five more characters in future waves? Oh my freaking gosh, let's go. So here we have Birdo. Who would have thought that Birdo was going to be added? as DLC. I didn't think they were going to do it, but here we are. Thank you so much to everybody who voted on uh, the poll for which character or which color of Birdo I was going to play uh, for this episode. The Black Birdo actually won. So I'm going to be playing as the Black Birdo. Once again, thank you so, so much to everybody who voted. So this is the cart combination for those of you that are wondering. I'm using the Pipe Frame, Retro Off-Road Tires, and the Peach Paracel. I don't really know why I'm choosing this cart combination. Here are the stats, by the way, for those of you that are interested. I just kind of randomly picked one because I didn't really know what cart combination to pick for Birdo. Anyways, here we freaking go. We have the Fruit Cup where we have Amsterdam Drift from Tour, Riverside Park from Super Circuit, DK Summit from Mario Kart Wii, and Yoshi's Island, a brand new track, the one that I'm most excited for. So without further ado, let's just get right on in to the Fruit Cup. All right, here we have Amsterdam Drift from Mario Kart Tour. It's looking good, it's looking good. I really like Amsterdam Drift in Tour. It's been a bit since we've seen Amsterdam Drift, eh, in Tour? I think so. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Let's freaking go. Okay, kind of a crappy start there, but what you gonna do? Oh my god, this is so weird to be playing as Birdo, a brand new freaking character. I mean, she's not brand new, but I mean, she hasn't been playable in a Mario Kart game for quite a while, since Mario Kart Wii, I guess. I mean, she's into her, but I mean, <laughs> I know a lot of people don't really play that game. Of course, I do. I love Tour, but not gonna lie, the last few Tours kind of been turning me off from the game, not gonna lie. All right, all right, I'm liking this track so far. I mean, it's your basic city track. We have an underwater section, let's go. I guess this was included, and in, I think Amsterdam Drift 2 is where we got the underwater section. So, let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Also, Birdo's rival. I have no idea if she has one. If I had to guess, it would be Yoshi or Shy Guy. I did, I did see Yoshi in this race, so I'm assuming it's probably Yoshi. Maybe Tanuki Mario. He's also um, giving us a little bit of run for our money, so... Yeah, it'll be interesting to see if Birdo has a rival, because I know some characters in this game don't have rivals. Like, King Boo randomly doesn't have a rival, even though I think it should be Luigi. Also, Lakitu doesn't have one. Link doesn't have one. So they might not bother with uh, rivals for these uh, these new characters. Ah, but this course just screams spring. It makes sense that they added it in this wave. I think that can kind of, uh, if it's a hint at anything, we kind of know what other tour tracks will be coming in the summer and which uh, ones will be coming in the winter. But there we go, Amsterdam Drift. That actually went pretty quickly. It was an okay track. Nothing super crazy in my opinion. Um, kind of just like all the other city tracks. They're, they're okay. Anyways, let's go on to Riverside Park. Okay, here we have Riverside Park from Mario Kart Super Circuit. This is one I am so freaking excited for. It just looks so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I love the glow up. That it got from uh, Mario Kart Tour, of course. This version based off of the Mario Kart Tour version. Which I'm totally okay with, because I think it looks pretty great. But not gonna lie, I didn't expect it to be added in the Booster Course Pass. I thought they were gonna wait to add it until uh, Mario Kart 9, but I was wrong. But here we have the Patooie Plants. I really want to see how these things work. If you hit them, the item that they're carrying actually 
falls off, but do you just use that item or collect it? I don't know. I guess we will have to wait and see about that. I guess I could try here. I do have a mushroom, so I shouldn't spin out if I run into one. Maybe that's what I'll do. If I could freaking see. Okay, never mind. Dang, blooper. But yeah, in the comments below, let me know what your favorite track is from the Fruit Cup. I have high expectations for Yoshi's Island, let me tell you that. That's probably going to be a lot of people's favorite track, because it's looking really freaking awesome. But I, I must say, I think I like this track better so far than Amsterdam Drift. No hate to Amsterdam Drift, it wasn't a bad track. I think this one, uh, I don't know, just more fun for me. Definitely a shorter track. Also, Pooh, I didn't mean to run into that. But I think we should still be good! No! What did I just do that for? What the heck am I doing? Okay, that was stupid. That was bull crap, let me tell you. <laughs> oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Uh, oh my god, Baby Daisy taking first place there. That is not good. Also, Toadette setting up to be our daily loser, so pick up the pace, Toadette. Come on. Also, Yoshi not being very much of a, of a threat to us, so maybe he isn't our rival. I don't know. Anyways, let's just forget that ending. Let's forget it. Didn't happen. Pixar didn't happen. And let's move on to DK Summit. All right, let's go. DK Summit from Mario Kart Wii. Definitely a fan favorite track from that game. Really, really glad that it's in this game. I must say, they're adding a lot of snow tracks. I am not hating on that because snow biomes are my favorite biomes. But they are definitely adding a lot. I am loving it. Okay, so I don't expect too many crazy changes to this track. Of course, this being a glider section now makes total sense. And of course, the half pipes are back from uh, Maple Tree Way in the last wave. I think there was another track that had them as well, but I can't think what it is at the exact moment. Merry Mountain, I believe. So yeah, I kind of want to see Alberto's trick animations. Also, let me know in the comments uh, if you are excited that Birdo is now in the game and which uh, color you're going to be rocking. I must say, if I would have uh, just picked myself, I probably would have gone with the orange one. Just because orange is my favorite color. Okay, oh, dang it, of course. Oh, where'd that red shell go? Okay, good. I ain't mad that it's gone. But, uh, yeah, it doesn't seem to be very many changes at all. The only major thing I saw was that the uh, barrel section is now a glider ramp, which was, of course, expected. Other than that, are there really any changes? Of course, it did get a little bit of a glow up. More based off of the, of course, Mario Kart Tour version. Also, I think that DK statue is different. I think it was a Mario statue in uh, the Wii version. Another blue shell? Are you freaking kidding me? Don't screw me over again, game. I already got screwed in the last race. <sighs> okay, as long as I beat Baby Daisy, that's kind of... My objective! Oh my gosh, if I would have fallen off there, I would have just thrown my controller, broke my switch, and just quit YouTube, let me tell ya. Okay, I don't see Baby Daisy on the mini-map, so I don't know where she plays. Okay, fourth. That is good. That is good. That will put me back in the lead, which is what I like to see. Uh, five points up. So, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm looking good. I, I, think, I, I think I got this. I think I got this, but you know... Famous last words, so I'll just zip the lip and move on to a brand new track, Yoshi's Island. Okay, here we go. I am so freaking stoked for this track. It looks so good. I love, 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 love that this track is a thing and all of the references to the Yoshi's Island series. 
Did you hear that? That intro music there. Also, did I spin out every single race here? Okay, I want to listen to the music here really quickly. As I run into every freaking end. Oh my god. <laughs> Mike, what the heck are you doing, buddy? Oh my gosh, this is so amazing. Oh my gosh, the lava there. Get out of here. Okay, okay. I'm liking this track. I see the blargs in the background. We like it. We like it. Also, wait. Th are those Yoshi coins? Those are or dinosaur coins, I mean. Those are freaking dinosaur coins from Mario World. Let's freaking go. Best track in the wave. Don't at me. Don't disagree. <laughs> Your opinion is wrong, even though an opinion can neither be wrong nor right, because there's no, neither fact nor fiction. It's just an opinion. But still, it's wrong. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is freaking insane. Like, nothing crazy with layout, but just the little subtle details, like the dinosaur coins and everything. Also, oh, I want to hit that, uh, the cloud there, because I know that will, like, create a bridge or something. Oh my gosh, the ring! Somebody hit it! Oh, and you get to drive through the ending ring goal from Yoshi's Island. Oh, it's been so long since I've played that series of those puff things. Puffy puffers. I don't remember what they're called. It's been a hot minute since I've played Yoshi's Island, like I said. And I kind of just skipped Yoshi's New Island because I heard it was poopy butt farts. So, I didn't want to play something that was poopy butt farts. So. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Do not mess this up. Where? Oh, the cloud. But, oh, the cloud changes. The cloud changes, y'all. The, the cloud changes. Oh my gosh. This best freaking track. Let's go. Yes! Oh my gosh. Nintendo. Nintendo. Oh my god. Best track, 10 out of 10. Don't even, don't even argue. You know it's true. You know it's true. Nintendo. Like they gave it the Mute City and uh, I believe Big Blue treatment with the ending music. This is great. This is great. Nintendo, I love you. I love you. Birdo. We've had our rough, our rough patches in the past, but I love you, Birdo. I love you, Birdo. Okay, let's move on to the results. Okay, I must say, this was a very, very solid cup. One of my favorite cups in the entire Booster Course Pass, let me tell you. I mean, the Moon Cup is still up there. I don't know if this surpassed the Moon Cup. I think it might have. Also, ignore that fourth place. Ignore it. Do not comment about it. I'm still salty. <laughs> but oh my gosh, there we go. That was great. 54 points, one star. You know what? I'll take it. And Koopa Troopa actually ending up as today's daily loser. So make sure you make fun of Koopa Troopa in the comments. Or as I like to call him, Koopa Poopa. So make fun of him all you want in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed what you saw here today, be sure to hit the like, smash that subscribe, and ring the bell to get notified when I upload future videos. Once again, I'm Mike Bryce, and I will see you in the next one.